Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Shenron Plays. I'm your host, Shenron, and we are back in the lands of Pacifica here in the Super States mod for EU4. Uh, we've been, um, well, we've been pretty good over here in northern Mexico. We have Sonora, Chihuahua, and Coahuila as our vassals. We're going to peacefully vassalize Tamaulipas at some point. Uh, maybe not right now. I'm thinking of annexing the Virgin Islands and Puerto Rico to get their wonderful, wonderful trade here in the Caribbean. It'd be about 30 ducats. It'd probably be about 30 ducats instead of what we're making now, which is 23 ducats. Well, maybe we keep the 23 ducats then. Uh, 15 here, and we're collecting here as well, right? Yeah, 8 ducats. I guess that's not too bad. Hmm, yeah, I don't know. I'll think about it. The thing is, we've had Virgin Islands and Puerto Rico as vassals for a long, 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 long time. So we can annex them whenever we want. Uh, it's just a matter of when is the right time, when would be the right reason to do it. And I think the right reason would be because trade flows into the Caribbean. Trade from Mexico, Panama, and the entire Pacific Coast, and Texas, all of that flows into the Caribbean. So I think it makes sense to uh, to move our trade capital, or even our, our, our capital there, and just dominate the Caribbean. That makes sense. And I noticed, I thought for sure that these colors here, I thought it was the same color. When I'm zoomed out, this looks like it's both Puerto Rico. But it's not. This island of St. Lucia is actually Quebec. I never noticed that. That blows my mind. I... And that makes me sad because we were at war with Quebec, right? When we vassalized Puerto Rico, we had to do that by going to war with Quebec. We were at war with Quebec. We could have taken that island at that point. But we didn't. Oh well. Anyway, we were also talking about finding a way to go to war with Texas. Uh, with the idea of making him split up. Because he has a bunch of cores that he could spit out. He could spit out uh, Lipan. He could spit out Comanche. He could spit out North Texas. He could spit out East Texas. Anything that he could spit out would be good because it re would reduce his internal base tax. North Texas would lower it by 10, Comanche would lower it by 12, Lipan would lower it by like 20, East Texas would lower it by 14. So every little bit makes a big difference in Texas' overall dominance, right? He really dominates this region. So what would we do? We would declare maybe on Arkansas, who's allied to Florida. No, that doesn't work. Declare on Illinois, Illinois. Ontario, Kansas, Ohio, and Texas. That could work. Kansas is weak. No, no, no. Oh, Kansas is my ally. Whoops. Hmm. Maybe we just wait for him to go to war, and then we can enforce demands. That might be good. I mean, enforce peace. That might be good. Anyway, in the meantime, we're saving up 600 ducats so that we can pay the nobles, because they're being whiny little bitches. Fucking nobles, man. They're always whiny little bitches. And uh, that's... Hopefully not going to give us a loan. But it might it might make it take a loan. I'm not sure. What's going on in the rest of the world? Well, you can see the Mamluks are doing awfully well. They have everything all the way out to Tunisia. And it looks like they've not really been going to war with the Ottomans. They don't have a truce or anything. They, they're not allies or anything. But they're not really fighting each other, which is really weird. Poland got a personal union over Sweden. And they're currently fighting... Uh, Russia to keep this personal union over Sweden. Now, if they can keep that union, I would not be surprised if uh, they demanded Norway and Russia and stuff to give lands back to Sweden, because Sweden has cores uh, all over this area. So I would not be surprised if uh, Poland made them give some land back to Sweden, but it's possible that they forget about it, or maybe they just don't care. Uh, Sweden has some Norwegian rebels, so that's fun. The HRE is doing okay. They did get one reform through, and everyone's still voting for Austria, despite him being a massive warmonger. They don't seem to care about that. Kansas has a ton of rebels. I wonder if they're going to succeed. It looks like they will. Yeah. Iowa is out. Iowa is out. Wait a minute. Is that new? Wasn't that part of Minnesota? Yeah. Okay, so Iowa has spat out from Minnesota. That's interesting. Oh, there goes the noble family request aid. Looks like we're going to take a loan. Darn it. All right. Oh, well. We'll pay back the loan. That sucks. 
Yeah, 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 we took a loan. I know. Well, in the meantime, let's do some buildings. Armories are complete. We could do some armories down here, but... Oh, no, it's still north. I was going to say, well, we don't get much manpower. Yeah, yeah, we do. This is still all North America, so of course you get manpower out of it. If it was distant overseas, it wouldn't get much, but... As North America, it's definitely not distant overseas. Explorer is ready to go out exploring again, so we'll do that. Missionaries are doing a pretty good job. What the hell? Massachusetts annexed Cape Breton Island. Cape Breton Island was independent? Oh, I didn't even know Cape Breton Island was an independent thing, but there it is. And now they're dead. Now they're part of Massachusetts. <laughs> Look at Massachusetts go. That is so crazy. It's so crazy. Okay, Thompson Nicola. Southern British Columbia has converted to the one true faith. Of course, of course. How are we looking on the religious map? Now we're looking okay. There's still a lot of work to do. We have converted some of the Mormon provinces, but there's still one, two, three, four, five, six more Mormon provinces to go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine provinces in North America. And that's probably it. Yeah, nine provinces to go. And then, that's, then we're pretty much done. And then the Mormon stuff. All right, so who's next on the list? Humboldt, only 17 months. Wow, that's quick. Okay, Humboldt it is. We're currently doing Utah, San Francisco, and Humboldt. Yep, looks good. Explorer man, let's explore, shall we? This way, and then this way, and then this way, and then over here. And over here, go find Taiwan, maybe. Come down this way. Go find uh, Saba. Is it Saba? I don't remember what the name of that province is. And come down to New Guinea. Look at that. There you go. And then come home. Dock up. Good man. I hope you don't die. But he might die. It's possible. We discovered the Andamans. Good, good. We discovered the Kalahari Desert. Oh, fun. Hello, Kalahari. If only we could colonize you. But alas. Okay, New York has finished his African colony. So where is he going? Where are you going, New York? Hmm. I don't see him anywhere. No, not yet. Native exploitation, of course, will assuage their suffering. As long as we're profitable. Have you cored this? Yes, he has. Okay, we can sell him his the very last province in Brazil. And I think that's the last we need to sell. It is. Can I have some cash, please? Thank you. 100 ducats for Mato Grosso. Enjoy. Are you coring it? Yes, you are. Good man. Yeah, save and load was all we needed to core that shit. Great. Add more provinces to the trade companies. True. Uh, yeah. Trade companies. Where? 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 South Africa. Yes. Trade companies. Add them in. Done. Uh, up here. I think I've done those. Those are done. Over here. Those are done. Yep. And over here, none of the colonies are finished. Yeah. But we're in Flores and Christmas Island, and we have a colonist on the way to Pose. Didn't we go to Pose? Or is it I forget? Oh, I forgot to go to Pose. Just cancel that mission. Whoops. I forgot to go to Pose. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. We had a mission to go colonize somewhere, and I forgot. <laughs> oh, goodness. Are we improving relations with Sonora? Yes, we are. Okay. Poor Sonora. All right, I think I'm going to stop demanding his trade, uh, New Mexico's trade power, because we're not really using it, and it's 
not going to get us a, a vassal. It's just not going to happen because relations are too fucked up now. Unfortunately. Uh, cancel. Yeah. Okay, Missouri. Florida and West Florida. Oh, wow. Kansas actually got rid of all of his rebels. Look at... I'm surprised. I'm very surprised because he was so busy in that war. Oh, no. My conquistador is dead. Oh, no. Uh, yeah, get a new one. Oh, wow, a 2-5. Robert Schwarzenegger. <laughs> Robert Schwarzenegger. You get him, boys. Oh, my goodness. So, should we get some marriages? If we get some marriages, we could wind up with a lot more legitimacy quickly. And that might be worthwhile. The problem is we can't marry any of these guys that are our vassals. It's just not a thing we can do. They're all republics. They're all republics. Can't marry any of them. Oh, right. Tamulipas. I should vassalize you. Do, do I want to do that before or after I annex some vassals? Mm. I think I should annex the Virgin Islands and uh, Puerto Rico. Yep, you guys have been vassals for long enough. Holy crap, annexing the Virgin Islands will cost 765 Diplo points. Wow. But I'm sure it's worth it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That'll get rid of one of our relationships. Then we can also annex Puerto Rico, which will cost how much? 450. Okay. Okay, come on back from the Virgin Islands. They're annexing. How long will that take? Four years to annex the Virgin Islands. Wow. Hey, we converted San Francisco to the one true faith. Welcome back, San Francisco. The wayward sheep has finally returned. To Grand. Oh, that'll look at that. No revolt risk anymore. It's all gone. And now we have to wait for some of these provinces to lose their modifiers when we accepted rebel demands. So Skeena Queen, let's take a look. How long until you? 1585, two years. Okay, it's not that bad. Yeah, two years we can do Skeena Queen. So that'll be the same for most places. Oh, we have a claim on Saskatchewan. How nice. Castile wants access. Yeah, what do you need access for, Castile? Are you at war with uh, Portugal? You are. Castile and Portugal are at war. Fun. Okay, how can we get into war with Texas? What can we do? Because I can't just declare on Texas. He is a coalition against me, and he's never going to leave the coalition. So how do we declare war on Texas? Allied with Arkansas, Illinois, and Tennessee. Hmm. I can't get any CB on Arkansas, Illinois, or Tennessee because they're, they're all landlocked. I can't fabricate on them. Uh, I can, I could ally them and call them into a war, and they would say no. That's possible. Maryland, Jersey, Texas, and West Florida. Hmm. No, I think it's still better to wait. We'll wait until the colonies go to war again. And then when the colonies go to war, we can enforce peace. That's the only thing I can think of. All right, I'm going to cancel my guarantee on you. Yep. So that gives us a truce, which is fine. Or it should give us a truce, right? No, no truce. Oh, yeah, there it is. So it shows on my screen, but not on his screen. Yeah, five-year truce, cancel and guarantee. Not a problem. Let's keep on building our manpower buildings. Oh, they're done. They are done. Okay, if the manpower buildings are done, then let's build the temples. Okay. And constables. Well, forts? Level 2 forts, anyone? Oh, yeah, the colonies need level 2 forts. Of course. Of course. And we're making 21 ducats a month, even while we're fully funding the army. That's nice. Which means I should probably lower the funding, because we don't have any revolt risk anywhere. And more money is good. We could also tech up, 
which would mean... Oh, new trade ships. Right, we do need new trade ships. Uh, but I can't tech up right now. Oh, shoot. Another, another diplomatic faux pas. This is the second one in a row, which is the exact opposite of having a statesman. Instead of plus five, you get negative five. That hurts, man. That fucking hurts. But I will take up the military. No, I'll wait till January. It might be cheaper in January. Maybe just a little bit. Oh, right. We have a loan. Okay, we can repay the loan next. Thank you for reminding me. West Florida broke their lines with Missouri. Okay. Rebels and Grand. Oh, well, should probably fund the army then. Fund the army. Swap in the 2 5 Super General. Robert Schwarzenegger. Good job, Robert Schwarzenegger. What a name. Who the hell names their kid Robert Schwarzenegger, you know? What a name. Explorer man, are you ready? He is. Okay, let's explore some more, shall we? Go up the coast here. Go up through uh, Taiwan. Go around. Discover some more fog of war. And... Da, 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 da. That's probably good enough. Come back to the Spice Islands. Do another ring around there. And then come home. Good man. Holy shit. Another personal union. Malwa and Arissa. Wow. That's, that's, I'm surprised how many personal unions are happening. Like all in a certain few years, right? All right, Humboldt has finished. Good. And the next one will be Skeena Queen. So we'll head up there. And we'll convert that as soon as it's available. As soon as the revolt, not the revolt, the um, religious zeal or whatever it is, is gone. Local autonomy. When local autonomy is gone. Ooh. Gain some ducats. Repay a loan. Don't mind if I do. Hello, Ming. What's up, dude? What's up? Ming is in a personal union under Korea. Uh, uh, what's with all these unions? Holy shit. Ming is in a personal union under Korea. That's kind of scary. Can you imagine Super Korea? I bet you can. I bet you can imagine Super Korea. Is this Japan? No, we didn't discover it. It looks like it's Japan. Okay, Kansas, you're still happy. Good. Wyoming, you're still in the coalition. Bad. Um, I mean, it's not the end of the world, but yeah, bad. Let's get relations up with Saskatchewan. Twitch chat's freaking out. Hui, 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 hui. Super Korea. Yeah. Yeah, no surprise. Alright, how are things with the with the vassals? They're pretty happy, except Sonora. Sonora's a little pissy. What's your problem, Sonora? Well, he just feels like being pissy. Ah, we discovered Halmahera. Good. Uh-oh. We would have lost control of the Curia if it weren't for those meddling kids. No, no, we would have lost control for the Curia, except that every single cardinal is from a different nation right now, so we keep control. Uh, we do have two of the possible cardinals in our pocket, but they're very old. Well, they're the oldest two of the, of the bunch. But we don't really have enough points to lock down all the cardinals yet. Later on, we'll have enough points to lock down all the cardinals. I plan on being the largest Catholic nation, getting a 7% uh, tax discount, which is kind of cool. Uh, tariffs on grain, okay. Each cardinal you control gives you 1% tax discount. So if you control all seven, you get 7% tax discount. It's rather nice.
Wow, is, is Puerto Rico, I mean, is uh, Virgin Islands going to put us over our limits? No way. <laughs> We're going to be way under our limits. Even after annexing the Virgin Islands. Okay, good. And Puerto Rico, you are still ready to annex. We can, we can hit the button on Puerto Rico. As the Virgin Islands are finishing, we will start the Puerto Rican annexation. I don't want to do them both uh, right away. Oh, ho, 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 Michigan is in Toronto. Someone in Twitch chat was freaking out. They're like, oh my god, Michigan owns Toronto. They didn't, but now they do. They're going to full annex Ontario. Oh my god. Oh, maybe they can't. Ontario annexed Montreal, so maybe maybe Michigan can't actually do that. We'll see. Michigan's going to full annex Ontario. That's hilarious. That is hilarious. And it looks like Sinaloa is... I'm not sure what he's doing. We've got an alliance with New Mexico. Good for you. Let's get relations up with you. France has no air. Oh my god. He's only 17. <laughs> France is a Habsburg. If France dies today, he gets the personal union under Austria. Wow. France is a Habsburg. Oh my goodness. Can we please get a marriage up in here? Now, negative 98 distance between borders. Oh, I wish. I fucking wish, man. Okay, let me cancel my military access in New Mexico. If I can get a diplomat. Okay. So is that war over? Yep, the war is over. Poland has taken land from Livonian order. The war is over, but Norway has a bunch of rebels. I'm sorry, Sweden has a bunch of rebels, and he lost some lands to Norway due to rebels. And he has even more Norwegian patriot rebels. So yeah, Sweden's actually getting smaller. <laughs> uh, it's quite funny. Oh, is that Catholic that I heard? It is! Okay, so here we are, 1585, the Pope has discovered the New World, and now everyone who was a disconnected Catholic instantly flips to regular Catholic. Now that was supposed to happen, so I'm glad that it did. It means we don't have to use that uh, event discover the Pope thing anymore. What was I going to do with this guy? Oh right, get rid of access. We did that, let's keep relations up though. I want them to stay happy despite no longer interested in being a vassal. That really is too bad. Oh well, no big deal, I guess. Yep, there you go, Bohuslan flipped. So, yeah, Sweden's just collapsing. And um, if these rebels succeed, these are pretender rebels, if these rebels succeed, that will instantly break the personal union with Poland. So Poland should be putting these rebels down, but the AI is... Stupid? Is that a good way of putting it? The AI is a fucking moron. So the AI will not put down rebels. Even if that means he's going to lose a personal union, he will still not put them down. Okay, let's convert uh, Juno. There you go. Explore? Let's go explore. Oh, go here first. And then here... And along the coast, and this way, and this way, and this way, and then back to Taiwan, back past Luzon, and Godoc. This explorer is getting a lot of prestige for us. We're at positive 89 prestige. Wow. Pretty cool. France still has no heir. Oh my goodness. I just... I wish we could marry him. 
We have room for one relationship right now. I wish we could marry him, but distance negative 98 just doesn't work, you know? Could go for some relations, though. Might be worthwhile. Hello, Diviet. And Lanzong. Hello. We should go find Korea. I want to see Korea. I want to see what the hell does Korea look like that they can keep a personal union over Ming. How, I mean, surely Ming would try to get independent, but no, they're not. Ah. Argentina wants to keep George Latham. You got it. He's doing God's work. There's Korea. Hello. He's allied with Dai Viet and Lan Zong. Okay. Uh, they're tech 10, just like China. Oh, his prestige is very low. He could wind up losing that union just to, just to, just to low prestige. Well, maybe. Of course you can have access. No problem. No problem. It's not like you coalition me or anything. That doesn't matter. All right, let's get relations up with Francie Pants. Can we do that? Yeah. If we could marry him, I would just be so happy. Don't really want the alliance, but the marriage, you know? Marriage could be beautiful. All right, well, it looks like that is the Korean border. So he doesn't have any extra land. This is just the land he begins with. I can't tell what nation is north of him. Some gray-colored nation. And this looks like Japan has conquered over here. Japan gets missions to conquer these provinces, so I'm not surprised that he has actually <laughs> succeeded up there. But it's quite amusing. Okay, let's go home. Dock up. You're getting hurt now. Okay. Uh oh, Minnesota, what happened? Oh no, Saskatchewan is invading Minnesota. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> well, goodbye, Minnesota. It was nice knowing you. It really was, but it's time for you to die, I guess. All right, let's get relations up with Chiapas. Yeah. And Quintana Roo? Are you small enough to vassalize? No, not even close. Virginia and Tennessee both won alliances. Well, Virginia, no way, but Tennessee, maybe. Tennessee might be good. Okay, what happens? Ontario will cede Montreal and Ottawa to Quebec. Okay, so Michigan got nothing out of that war. Oh, Michigan. Oh, Michigan. Ontario took Montreal and Ottawa. Oh, Michigan, you got gypped. Minnesota will cede Clay and Grand Forks to Manitoba. Oh my god, Minnesota, you're so small. Manitoba, you're so big. How does Manitoba and Saskatchewan keep their alliance despite having this massive border? I don't know. You would think with that huge border they would lose their alliance somehow. But, uh, let's see. No. They're both at plus 200. Historical friend. Royal mar Oh, they're royally married to each other. What the fuck? So the Canadian provinces can all marry each other. That's weird. That's very weird. Oh well, who am I to judge? Who am I to judge? Oh, Wyoming, just leave the fucking coalition, man. You don't need a coalition more. Who's this? What's up? Chiapas wants access. You got it, Chiapas. You got it. 
Uh oh, Sinaloa is at war with Nuevo Leon and Durango. About what? Haliscan conquest. Oh god, Halisco. Halisco, you are scary. Hmm. Why are you so scary, Halisco? Yeah, I know we can marry Canada, it just doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Why do the Canadian provinces marry each other? I don't get it. Why? There you go. Yep, Sweden has broken free from the personal union with Poland because of pretender rebels. Oh, Poland. I can't say I'm sorry for you. But I'm sorry that the AI is so stupid. And they immediately get an alliance. <laughs> God damn it, Poland, you're so dumb. It's not Poland, it's the AI. Uh, repay the loan, we did. Oh, wow. Still making 25 ducats. Great. More temples? No, the temples are done. Okay. Now we can do one more. Oh, we can do some down here, yeah. Temple. Manpower? Yeah, the manpower is done. Temple and manpower is done. Constables. Yeah. Constables. Constables. Presence in India. Incorporate Sonora. Create a fleet. Nah, not going to do any of those. Presence in India would be so awkward. Alright. Uh, Explorer dude. Come on up here again. Go find him more stuff. Yep, there's Japan. Interesting. Hey, we converted to Utah. Great. So southern Utah is now fully converted. We still have to do, do Grand and Salt Lake. But uh, those are going to take a lot of time. Next up is Skeena Queen. All right, done. Go, my friend. Go. Yes, and deedly doodly. Deedly doodly, needly noodly. Deedly doodly, noodly noodly. Needly noodly, doodly doodly. France still has no heir. Should totally get a marriage, but he doesn't want it because we're too far apart by quite a lot. Negative 101, too far apart. Damn it, why are we so far apart? Why are we so far apart? Kansas has insulted us. Are you kidding me? friendly. So why'd you insult me, you dumbass? What kind of a douche who's friendly sends an insult? You know what it is? It's because he got an event. The event was either lose relations or lose stability. So he chose to lose relations. Either that or it was gets a claim on you event. Both of them cause an insult. Alright, let's get relations up with our, our only ally. There you go. We might, we might seek Tennessee as an ally. It's possible. I could see that happening. They don't hate each other. So long as they don't hate each other, it could work. Uh, they're not allies, though. But that doesn't mean it doesn't work, right? Tennessee and Arkansas could be good buddies for me. Florida might be a good buddy as well. That's possible. Hmm. Florida, maybe. New York, maybe. Maryland, maybe. No, not New York. I want to go to war with New York. I want to take these lands here. I do. I really do. I really, really, really do. Uh, yes. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Alright, so let's start annexing Porta Derpico. Wait a minute, how many is this? One, two, three, four. Okay, good. That won't be a colon colonial nation. Oh, I wonder if I can sell them to Cali. No, I don't think so. Because Cali wouldn't have a way to core them. Yeah, we'll have to go to war with North Carolina to take this shit. Once Cali has eaten Texan Columbia, then we can go to war with North Carolina and feed them these provinces, and then we can sell them this shit. One step at a time, Shen, one step at a time. All right, so let's get a diplomat back from Sinaloa. Yeah. And Puerto Rico, it's time to go, baby. Goodbye, Puerto Rico. This is going to drive our diplomatic points into the ground, but that's okay. 
It's also going to drive our legitimacy down to 52. I'm also okay with that. Alright, please go through there. And come around the south. Oh, our colony in Rogueville has finished. Great. Can we please build a fort there? Thank you. And do I want to colonize the coast here? I sort of do. Sort of do, sort of don't. Kind of damned if you do, damned if you don't. Right. We're going to have to build a military presence if we want to colonize there. Or we could just colonize up here. Which is probably a better option. So let's do that. Because we already have an army here anyway. We'll just put half of them down there. And then we'll put less than half of them down there. There you go. Keep 19 guys here. Why do you not have a general? You should always have a general. You can have uh, this idiot. Our king. Yeah, that idiot. The 151 king, who's pretty useless as a king. And he's not too good on the battlefield either. Oh well. Hmm. Okay. And go home. Hopefully you survive. If not, well, nice knowing you. Oh, two more months and then Virgin Islands are gone. Twitch chat saying we should do the Presence in India mission and just take Ceylon. Yeah, that would work. We might do that. There you go. Goodbye, Virgin Islands. Lose 10 legitimacy. Oh, look, look at that. Look how gorgeous that is. Okay, now we have a bunch more ships. What do we want to do with these ships? We have 16 galleys, which I don't think we need. And 12 more transports. You know, we might want to keep them there because we don't have the uh, Panama Canal yet. I, I imagine we can build it at Tech 23, but we don't have it yet. So... Yeah, we're, we're, we're going to want a fleet up here, Mexicali. We need one fleet for this coast, and we'll have a fleet for the Caribbean as well. And a transport fleet, I mean. But, uh, yeah, we should move our capital over here now and start collecting trade. Oh, baby. Look at that. Just by annexing this guy, we're now making 11.8 ducats off this trade. So good. All right, you guys ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you, are you ready? Are you ready? You ready? Are, are you ready? Blam! Pacifica's capital is now Havana, Cuba. Yes. Oh, yes. Havana, you're so delicious. Yes. Hmm. How much does it cost to culture convert this shit? Eleven. Nah, I'm not gonna bother. Fantastic. All right, so that's gonna do it for this episode. Thanks for joining me, guys. I have been Shen. There's some more ships we can delete. You have been you. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed our time together today. Our capital is Cuba. I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.